Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Sagittarius, this is your reading for the month of uh, September 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. En energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay. Also Sagittarius, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I'd also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified notified whenever I upload the videos. There is an extended reading for this one. If you are interested in the same, if you are excited to know what your person told you thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and your person, you can go ahead and you can check out the link that has been provided in the description box and also in the comment section. Okay. Uh, we see. We will also see who is the new person coming your way in the extended reading. Now coming back to this reading on YouTube, Sagittarius, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent your energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with. In between, I'm going to place a couple of cards and they will represent the mutual energy between you and your person. Okay, so let's get started now. Sagittarius, let's get started. So we have Ace of Swords, we have is the World and we have is the King of Cups. Then we have is a Ten of Wands, we have is Page of Wands, we have is Two of Swords, Knight of Pentacles and we have is Knight of Swords. Okay. So Sagittarius, what I feel is that you may be dealing with uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Taurus, Leo. Scorpio Aquarius okay so if the sign pops up all the better let's not remain fixed on the signs okay Sagittarius first of all with that world card I'm getting an energy that you're being asked to be yourself maybe you were not in your element when you were uh, in this romantic relationship with the past person so what do I mean that when I say that you were not in your element is probably you were compromising a lot in this relationship. You did a lot of things to please your person and you kept on doing those things only with an expectation that someday your person will think about you. Someday they will be nice to you. Someday they will do what you want. Okay. So you kept on giving, you kept on giving, you kept on giving, which was out of your element. You were acting out of your element. That's not who you are. Okay. You are a very strong personality. You are a very uh, strong headed person. You are someone who, of whom you have a, you have a strong leadership personality, Sagittarius okay and you are not someone who will keep on compromising all the time you are not a person who will keep on succumbing to uh, the whims and fancies of any Tom Dick and Harry right so what I feel is that the universe is asking you why I'm saying that the universe is asking you to be yourself Universe is asking you to get back in your element. Universe is asking you to be true to yourself is because I'm getting attracted towards this nude lady. Nude lady, this nudity represents purity. Okay. Nudity represents originality. Right. So you have been asked to be yourself. Stop being someone else just because you want to be someone or just because you love someone and, uh, you know you will you, you keep on compromising all the time okay so universe is asking you to be yourself and you when you were with this past person you were not in your element you were acting out of your element okay and what I see with that with that ace of swords along with the world card universe is trying to tell you that be yourself and start uh, proceed with your life but be true to yourself okay and you're like a universe is like don't worry I am there I'm protecting you 
okay you don't have to worry i'm protecting you you don't have to worry to be yourself okay you know the world is not going to fall apart if you decide to be yourself okay and you know a universe is like i am protecting you with that big sword if anyone tries to mess around with you while you are being yourself i will that person will have to deal with my sword okay and you are but your soul is a bit scared you are like okay if you are telling me uni- universe that i should be myself i will be myself but please continue protecting me okay I, and universe is like you proceed at least you start proceeding in your life and don't worry you don't have to look behind because because i am always there behind you protecting you okay so i i'm getting a strong message that universe is asking you to be yourself okay and universe it's like indirectly you are also becoming a very strong person sagittarius you are transforming you're shedding your old skin uh you know you're shedding your skin old skin like a snake and you are transforming as a new person and this new person is someone who is very strong someone who will not take any kind of nonsense from anyone okay in the past during the past relationship also you left that person because you thought that enough is enough now now i need to leave this person i cannot keep on tolerating their tantrums or i cannot keep on tolerating their nuisance uh, their nuance and uh, so you decided to move away so you were already in that phase when you decided to move away from that person you were already you had already started transforming yourself okay and what i feel is that you are going to become very powerful very very powerful person and people like you know people like past like your past person they will think 10 times before they can mess around with you and what i'm sensing is that because you are on the verge of becoming a strong person you are at, uh, you are attracting equally strong soulmate for yourself sagittarius someone who is strong someone who is of a level of a king is going to enter in your life a king or a queen is about to enter in your life and this person look even if they are a king of cups okay even if they are very romantic at heart at the end of the day this person is a king or a queen you cannot forget that this person has this person is at the top because of because of who they are because of the power they have right and uh, someone very powerful is entering someone who is just like you and what i'm sensing is this is going to be a very intense relationship okay highly emotional highly intense like i don't see like you won't be both of you won't be able to stay from one another uh you know stay away from one another for long it's like both of you will instantly start missing one another so i see this relationship with the next person escalating quite quite fast escalating to the next level is quite fast so let's talk about your person now 10 of wands page of wands and we have as two of swords your person is missing you and that's why they are dropping all unwanted relationships from their life now okay they are trying to remove the unnecessary burden from their life and they are only realizing that they wanted no one else except you okay so look at this it's like this person is dropping the 10 wands so they were carrying unnecessary a lot of unnecessary burden okay and uh, the burden of unnecessary people burden of unnecessary situations probably this person was quite image conscious they were like what the society is going to think and what this and what that probably yours was this relationship with the past person was an unconventional relationship okay for some of you it was uh for some of you this person had lot of ego for some of you this person was being influenced by wrong people around them 
because some of them their family was opposing this connection this person was codependent on others for their own life decisions and what i see is that they are dropping all those relationships which were sort of keeping them away from you okay they are missing you they are thinking about coming towards you with an offer okay a passionate offer but at the same time it should look stable as well wondering how they can come towards you what all they should say okay this person has lot of feelings but they are they are thinking quite rationally right now uh, they are trying to take an unbiased perspective towards this relationship and they know that they will have to apologize you because they uh, committed uh, big mistakes in the past so expect an apology expect some communication with a knight of pentacles and knight of swords for some of you there will be option between two people for some of you for i see clashes are going to happen between you and the past person there will be a fight between you and the past person okay the past person wants to come towards you they want to stop you from moving on and moving away what i'm sensing is that you are very slowly steadily at least some of you some of you are at least uh, slowly and steadily moving away from this person and your person is sensing that they want to stop you before it is too late okay all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading then you can go ahead and check out the link that has been provided in description box and also in the comment section link is about the extended reading we see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and your person we'll also see who is a new person coming your way okay all right bye bye then